Hello folks, how you guys doing? My name is Mark. This is UCD Toy Reviews. How's it going? So I got something a little different here. These are Kishi Surprise figures of the Universal Monsters uh, from Super 7. So Dracula, Bride of Frankenstein, The Mummy, uh, The Mole Man, <laughs> right? And uh, Wolfman and Frankenstein, stuff like that. And I've kind of had these for a little while, just been sort of sitting on them, so I figure I'll make a video here. So Super 7 is a company that um, makes stuff like this. They uh, had the muscle franchise for a little bit and they made like He-Man muscles and Mega Man muscles and Aliens muscles. And they also had the He-Man license for a bit. So they put out like Club Eternia, you know, and then also like uh, new He-Man 5.5 action figures, that kind of thing. So they're really cool. They're uh, an indie toy company that, uh, you know, if you're into this stuff, please check them out, super7.com. Anyhow, so these guys, the cool thing about these is they came in blind boxes, but if you just wanted to get the full collection, then you could just straight up buy this. I think I got this for about 20 bucks at a con a few months ago. Take a look at the packaging. You know, here goes all of our monsters. Here goes Frankenstein and the Bride and the Mummy and the Wolfman. I think that's a, the Mole Man, I think, or no, no, that's the Invisible Man. That's what that is. And then, of course, Dracula. And we could take a look at the back. Same sort of thing. Here goes all of our different um, Universal Monsters, <laughs> right? Stuff like that. Pretty cool stuff. Um, so Super 7 always does this kind of thing for like Halloween and everything, but this this particular set is, is a little bit older. But we're gonna go ahead and tear this open. So the cool thing about this is that, well, you could get these in blind boxes, and but the Riot of Frankenstein was exclusive to this, so this was the only way that you could get the Bride of Frankenstein. So let's uh, let's check these guys out one at a time. Here goes Frankenstein, kind of zoom in on him. Pretty good sculpt in there, you know. His face is easily recognizable. And yeah, these are sort of like made out of that sort of gummy plastic that like, you know, muscle figures were. If you guys remember muscles from like the 80s, <laughs> right? That kind of thing. So let's put him there and let's move this packaging away. Then here goes the Bride of Frankenstein. She's like big and creepy. That actually looks really cool. Kind of like that. It's like you can even like see like details in her like irises and stuff <laughs> right pretty cool pretty cool and then you got the mummy the classic version of the mummy like brah. if you haven't actually seen the mummy the mummy i think is one of the better universal uh monster flicks and then of course dracula you know based on the belly bagosi version of dracula from universal very nice very nice pink dracula of course is always really cool then you have yeah this is the invisible man i thought this was the mole man at first but it's the invisible man so he's got like bandages and glasses there <laughs> and a robe <laughs> you know pretty cool stuff this was a good movie too if you've uh if you've never seen any of the universal classics uh definitely check out the invisible man and of course lon cheney as the wolf man and that actually, like, check out the sculpting on that, man. That's actually really nice. It's like you can see, like, individual hairs and, like, his eyes are all sunken and you can see, like, his teeth and shit. I probably should have done this video yesterday for Halloween, huh? <laughs> so, let's take a look at these guys. Let's zoom in on them. Very, very nice, you know? They're uh, a nice little fun little set like that. Um... I've always really loved stuff like this. I used to collect muscles, muscle men back in the 80s, and I still have like a significant, uh, significantly sized um, collection of minifigures. You know, the cool thing about minifigures is that you can buy a whole bunch of them and they don't take up a lot of space. <laughs> so they're really cool. Anyway, this is a fun little package. I think, I don't even think you can get these anymore on the website, but they're pretty common on eBay. It runs about 20 bucks or so. And uh, this particular set, like I said, is the only way to get um, the Bride of Frankenstein there. So anyhow, folks, that's all I got. Take it easy.